Ladies and gentlemen, what's up, your friends? Make it a gentle A. We coming at you with another episode of Don't Starve Rain of Giants here on Ape Plays. Last episode, we got bopped multiple times in the head by these freaking annoying frogs. I think I do remember that happening. Um, essentially, we need to make sure we don't get killed by these guys. I really want to try to get myself some armor, if at all possible. Uh, that would be really good for us, if I'm to be completely honest with you. One, two. I also heard recently, through the way of the comments, that the reason I'm taking so much um, sanity loss is because of the fact that um, I'm wet. And that's really annoying, if I'm to be completely honest. Um, I don't know what's going to happen with these frogs, honestly. Uh, it's a little bit annoying having these guys here, if I'm to be completely honest with you. Um, if I had a parasol, that'd be really good also. Do I, can I actually make one? Yes, I can. I'm really low on grass, so I'm gonna try to do that now. I really have to take a mental note of what I need to do at this point. Um, I'm pretty sure, like, the frogs made me, like, completely forget what I was trying to do. Does this count as a bath? It probably does, because you're losing sanity so fast. Um... Yeah, I have no idea how that was related to each other, but it was, and that happened. Holy crap, these, did these things really get owned this badly? Oh, snap, frogs versus, oh snap, this is intense battle of the ages right here. Frogs versus beefalo, who will win, At who will come out as the victor? Probably the freaking beefalo, if not, I think about it. Oh god, oh god, oh god. I mean, he'll hit so much, so much. I have to dodge these beefalo or these uh, frogs, though. Oh man, the frogs actually managed to kill one of them. That's crazy. Let's pick up all this, though. See if I can't get food out of this. That's crazy, though. Oh man, so much death, so much death, and death equals food. Soggy frog legs, appetizing. Oh god! I didn't know these guys were still aggroed. I so very much apologize, bro. I apologize. I'm sorry. Just leave me alone if you could. Thank you. I need to shoot up my sanity. Let's do that. I don't know why I did that. That was kind of pointless, if I'm to be completely honest with you. Let's eat. Beasts are approaching. And when the beasts, beasts are approaching, that means dogs. So that's a little bit scary. My sandy is has taken such a major hit, honestly. Um, so that's a little bit bothersome. I'm trying to see if I can pick stuff up here, food-wise. This is extra death everywhere, honestly. Did I catch a frog in this? I did. Wow. Well played. Oh crap. Let's run. Let's run. Oh, please. Not me. Not me. The dog. Kill the dog if you could. Kill the dog. Kill the dog. Not me. Please kill the dog. Thank you. Oh god. Oh, this is such a terrible situation. Could we actually die here is what I want to know. What is the odds of us dying in this situation? Very high. Oh, snap. Dogs versus beefalo. So much death is happening right now. So much death. Wow. Wow, that's a lot of death. Alright, let's go home because screw this. Sandy is so far dropped already. It's actually pretty crazy. Uh, we are we need to kill things. I have learned that once I kill things my sandy actually shoots up exponentially. So I need to really work on killing more things. Oh, this is very bad. What the heck? I didn't know that that there were that many. Okay then. That's Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Tank. Kill all the things! No more grass. 
Oh my gosh, I'm getting wrecked. Wow, I have no grass left. Just run away, Tim. Just run away if you could. Cook. I may or may not have to stoop from running from my base right now. I gotta pick up all the grass that I left behind also. That that was intense. Wow. Did not even predict that at all. A frog is out on the ocean right now, just not giving a care about anything or anyone in the vicinity. So we have a lot of food right now, that's good. Um it's actually really good for us. Frogs are annoying is what I've come to believe. Oh crap, yeah, let's not equip that. Can I get my spear back? Do I have two gold is the question. Crap. Phone. Really do hate these frogs. They're just annoying at this point. I really do need to work on picking up all my grass that I dropped though. That sucked. Man, already we've taken so much damage. That was a battle right there. That was the battle of the five armies. Frogs versus beefalo versus dogs versus Tim. Essentially, versus Wakeford, I mean. That was intense. See how my sanity is dropped so low right now. I really need to focus on killing things. Uh, would prob that would probably be a great idea. I really don't want to kill these these frogs, though. Just because of the fact that in numbers, these things are actually incredibly dangerous. Oh, man. I was supposed to talk about things this episode. Um, and I can't right now because I'm this is so intense. Um, so, yeah. My sanity's at 64 right now. I'm surprised uh, the hands haven't started uh, peeking out already. So we have one piece of grass left. So low on materials, honestly. It's actually a weird jump from the last episode where we had like a decent amount of stuff. That was so intense. Wow. I did not expect that. Yeah, I was actually supposed to talk about like channel updates and things like that uh, during this episode. But this game, man... The game doesn't let you do that. The game does not let you do that. So you're gonna hit day 56. We are in summer. Holy crap on crap. Oh god. Did not expect that. Uh, endothermic fire pit. If I could refine four of these without problem, that'd be great. Okay, we we almost got four up. These frogs are just killing me right now. Okay. What else do we need? An electrical doodad. I know that. Two, and then we need two electrical doodads. Where can I get electrical doodads is what I want to know. Um, so yeah, we dried up really fast. Apparently, I'm pretty sure this red tint indicates the summer season arriving. Um, so that's cool. Really hoping... These frogs don't stay on my butt this whole time. That'd be really cool if they didn't. Oh, frogs, you suck at life. I don't like you. Stop hitting me. I can't hit this thing either because the fact that straight up I'll die. Yeah, they'll, they all just came to attack me right now. There's three on my butt right now. I can probably take these guys one at a time. Um... Oh, yeah, I can't. I can't. There's just so much bad stuff happening right now. Jeez. The real question is, do we have enough for an electrical do- Do we have stuff for an electrical doodad? Um, don't we refine electrical doodads? Pretty sure we do. No, we just find them. Where can I- Oh, it's in the refine tab. There we go. Isn't it? Shouldn't it be in the refine tab? All the things. Oh, God. Man, day 56, guys. Day 56, and we're still alive somehow. Barely. We are barely hanging on to life right now. One wrong move in this game, and we could be dead right away. But our, um,. We're straight into summer right now, I get I'm pretty sure this is the summer season. 
Um, so that's a little bit scary. I don't know what our temperature needs to be at for us to start freezing, or for us to start burning. So hopefully, oh, that's what I want. I want this. Oh, ice. There we go. Ice. Let's, can I put you in there? Nope. Let's drop you there. Ice in our inventory. Where can I put the ice? How can I use the ice? I'm pretty sure there's something I can make that will allow me to stay alive. Ice cube. 24, 4, and 2. Oh, we have the 4. Where can we get electrical doodads? That's so weird. Electrical doodads, where you at? We are going insane very quickly, actually. I want to get into combat right now. It's just for the fact that I straight up can't. Oh, the rabbit holes are open. Yay. Okay, there's sanity. Um, man, okay, the rabbit holes are starting to open up again which is good um, so this means essentially that I can start um, actually getting food from easier spots now not that it matters um, can I actually make myself a garland that'd be great suit up my sandy a lot drop these guys okay you know what you need to be in here for now where can I get electrical doodads Ain't that the question of the day? I need electrical doodads and I straight up don't know where to get them. I'm actually, I probably should look it up right now uh, just to figure out how to not die at this point. Yeah, I'm looking it up. I should pause. Professionalism Tim right here. Because it's so pert. I don't ever do this, just it's the fact that I don't know where to get them. Doodads. Come on. Where do I get electrical doodads? Crafting. Oh, it's under science. Genius. Science. There we go. Okay, that's good. That's very, very good. I'm sad we don't have more gold, but whatever. I didn't think we'd need gold. Oh. Oh no, do we not have gold? Crap. Don't tell me we don't have gold. Oh no, that's not good. That's just very not good. Okay, so officially, we're in a position that we need. Oh god. Yeah, that's gonna pick ourselves up a lot. Um, okay, what do we need? What do we need? What do we need? What do we need for an ice cube? We need 10, 4, and 2. What do we need for a melon? I think I can deal with the melon for now. Uh, it should be there. 1. Okay, we have enough for that. That's good. I'm actually going to use this to my advantage. Drop that there. And then let's pick ourselves up a fashion melon. Boom. Boom. That should... Yeah, there we go. There you go. Um, I need to eat. I need to eat big time. The color tint for... This is just insane, honestly. Really want to skirt around this thing. So winter, essentially, is about keeping your sanity low. So that's what I'm trying to, or keeping your uh, temperature low. So that's what I'm trying to do, essentially, at this point. Um, I need gold, officially. That's a thing that I really, really need. Um, I'll stretch this episode out until day 50, 58 hits. That'd probably be a good idea. Let's put you in there. We need to organize our inventory a little bit, also. I noticed that we have a very unorganized in inventory right now. Do that, do that, do that, 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 and we're good. Okay, and then let's let's actually take this one on our way out. 
Okay, so we need gold officially for the electrical doodad for an endothermic fire pit. That's what I'm really worried about th at this point. I really need an endothermic fire pit. So I'm going to head up north and then hopefully not die. Um, yeah, I definitely need a more more gold for more endothermic fire pits. If I do recall, I did have actually a high amount of gold. It's just the fact that I didn't think I needed it, so I just dropped it. And apparently, we had a lot of cut stone also. That's my bad for wasting. Okay, we're good. We should head home, or we should head to north pretty soon here, just to pick ourselves up the needed materials for for um for electrical doodads. That's probably a good idea. We need a lot of gold. That's what matters right now. Come on, yay, sanity. Oh man, the tough situation about this is our sanity drops when we're wet. So that sucks. That sucks a lot. But the rabbit holes are open, which is great. Uh, rabbits are going to start pouring out of those. Um, if I can get some free kills out of the raccoons, that would make me a very happy person. Man, this, this LP just got seriously pretty tough pretty fast. I'm going to equip this for now, um, just to keep our sanity up. Once we start burning a little bit, I'll I'll re-equip that. Okay, there's that. We don't need this anymore, so I'm gonna leave that there. Let that go away. I need to pick up flowers. That's why I have the. Uh, I need to pick up my sandy. That's why I have the garland on. Uh, but sooner than later, we are gonna have to put on this watermelon. Uh, just because of the fact that it, we need it to keep our. Um, we need to keep our temperature temperatures in the lows. Okay, let's do that. Good. Hopefully, we can pick ourselves some flowers. The problem with this is our closest area for uh, gold, our closest reliable area for gold, is so far up north that we have to travel actually like one and a half days in total, just going there and getting back home. So it's a little bit tough to worry about that. But you know, I feel like we can do work. Um, surviving through it um, yeah I feel like we can do a decent amount of work yeah we also have f good food so that's good we still have a touchstone that's always comforting to walk by I apologize for the for the very dark commentary essentially um, it's been tough honestly tough to keep to keep um, to keep focused uh, during a commentary like this this is an intense episode I won't lie Intense battle is what this is going to be called. Intense, intense battle. So I'm glad I know how the uh, watermelon works. I'm I'm assuming it's not as um, as effective as the ice cube because if you haven't seen the ice cube yet, um, pretty much the ice cube essentially is a gigantic block of ice on your head uh, that rests there to keep your to keep your um, to keep your temperature low during the during the summer so essentially that's where we're at with that I'm surprised we haven't gotten attacked by a giant yet that's really cool okay keep going keep going do we have yes we do so we need gold what do we, what can we drop um, what can we drop I don't really need this at this point so I'm gonna go ahead and drop this we need gold gold is priority right now don't really need that meat. It's it sucks dropping that, but we definitely need gold more than we need meat right now. Okay, let's travel over here a little bit, pick ourselves up as much gold as physically possible. Our stats aren't great, I won't lie to you. Our sanity has has picked up just from this journey out of picking up flowers, but our health is still really low. Um so yeah, that's where we're at with that. Okay, pick up gold on gold on gold on gold. We definitely need this endothermic fire pit as soon as possible, though. It's comforting to know that we have already gotten attacked by dogs, so that's good. Um, so we don't have to worry about that later. I'm going to get some free sanity from this butterfly. If I can. Nope, missed. Let's get this. 
So we should hit, this is probably going to be a little bit of a longer episode, <clears throat> excuse me, um, but pro yeah, it's probably going to be a little bit of a longer episode just because of the fact that I paused to look up where to pick up the um, electrical doodads. That's ah, my bad, I completely forgot uh, where to pick that stuff up. Let's make another one of these guys. It's good having these longer day cycles, I mean our sanity still takes the hit from um, being wet from this watermelon, but it's fine, honestly, it's not a huge deal just because of the fact our stats are continuously staying boosted from all the stuff we're doing. Uh, I want to try to torch back, honestly, I want to torch back. Nine gold isn't a lot, but it should be enough for what we really need at this point. Okay. 10 should be fine, honestly. Let's let's try to head home uh, with the torchlight that we have. Should probably make another one of these just in case. What can I drop? I'll probably eat this meaty stew sooner than later. Start heading home. Okay. But it got intense fast. I did not expect combat to be that intense like as soon as we started the episode we got into a fight uh, so that was pretty that was pretty intense it's, it's good footage I won't lie but it, it makes me a little bit uncomfortable because I really want to get to day 100 uh, in this I probably just jinxed myself from not getting it because it's happened before um, but here's to hoping Wigfrid is looking quite stylish if I do say so myself in her very new beautiful hat um, keep running we're so far away from home. Where is home? Yeah, well, f home is really far away right now. I doubt we'll make it there by the end of the night cycle. Hoping we can, though. Yeah, there's not much to say. We're just walking back. You guys have seen this journey before. Uh, oh, it's. Oh, hell, heck yeah, dude. So good. So good. We needed that. We needed that full moon. It's great. Perfect. Perfect full moon for the win. Is that butter? It's stale though. Can't even eat butter. Let's eat. Boom. Put that up there. A little bit, bit of a sandy boost. So we're keeping our temperature relatively low, which is good. And this is just so far away from us. Uh, we should be able to make, when we get home though, the, um, we should be able to make the endothermic fire pit. I probably should have worked, whoa, that is, what the heck, that is really creepy. So many new things, so many new things. I'm wondering what else is actually affect. I'm lagging for some reason. I'm wondering what else is affected actually by the, um, yeah, I don't know why I'm getting frame rate. What is affected by the full moon? Uh, it's real. It, it's probably going to be really interesting to see what is actually affected by the full moon. I don't know why I'm getting frame rate right now. I apologize, guys. Um, weird little frame spike here. It's probably because of the night. I'm gonna, trying to go into the map just so I can recover frame rate a little bit, but it just drops right away. Um, so yeah, we're getting a little bit of frame rate. That sucks. We won't get as home as fast as I thought. We won't get home as fast as I thought. What's the time like on this episode is what I want to know. You guys are probably going to be seeing a little bit of new things here on the channel relatively soon. Oh, there's our frame rate back. I don't know why our frame rate was weird uh, going into that. But that's okay. Yeah, I might drag this episode out a little bit longer than I should. Or I probably should stop it uh, once Day 58 hits because that's what I've been doing uh, relatively always pretty much let's ditch the rocks if we don't really need rocks but for now guys and thank you guys so much for watching as usual my name is tim aka general 8-bit uh we are full into summer right now the tint on the screen is red which indicates summer uh so day 56 i think was the day winter started so that or summer started so that's pretty cool and thank you guys so much for watching as usual my name is tim aka general 8-bit i am actually going to go ahead and end off this episode here and uh, yeah, we'll pick it up right here in the next episode. Until next time, guys, thanks so much for watching.